The numbers are numbing. More than one third of all domestic violence victims in Dallas are African American women. This is Domestic Violence Awareness Month and a rally against intimate partner violence and sexual assaults hopes to draw attention to the problem and make some lives whole again. Fox 4's Sean Rapp has our story. That rally against domestic violence and sexual assault happens here at the Martin Luther King Center tomorrow. Listen, across South Dallas and Oak Cliff, some of the highest rates of family violence. 75216 actually is possibly the most dangerous zip code for women in our city. East Oak Cliff, near Lancaster and Loop 12. It's why Genesis Women's Shelter opened an outreach center in this zip code. We're full. We're full all the time. The phone is ringing all the time. We know that there is not enough help out there. Genesis now has a 24-hour text line put in place after phones went down during last February's winter storm. It has been such an incredible safety measure. Uh, we have had texts from women who say, you know, he's in the shower, I've only got about five minutes, uh, or uh, I'm in the shower and he's downstairs, but I may have to hang up right away. And I have to tell you, it has bypassed the number of helpline calls almost two to one. Sergeant Jonathan Bruinsma, Dallas Police Domestic Violence Unit. Over the last year or so, there has been a change in the makeup of the domestic violence unit. And what that has allowed us to do is put um, dedicated resources into uh, investigating these crimes. We actually work with the perpetrators of domestic violence. Bridget Vincent O'Neill teaches a state accredited 24 week course to help offenders be different. Intensive, uh, specifically geared towards changing the behavior, the abusive behavior. It's just giving me tools to try to work with that relationship, but it doesn't mean that it has been the saving grace for everything. But it's better. But it's better. Saturday, the city of Dallas and First Choice Social Services holding a rally against domestic violence and sexual assault. It's the first one that I'm aware of in this area, and we want to bring awareness to the, the reason why domestic violence happens. So the rally against domestic violence and sexual assault here at the King Center starting at 11 a.m. Saturday morning, gonna have speakers, gonna have resources to help folks make their lives whole.